Dear students, in this module, we are going to talk about the remedial approaches to drug abuse. How we can curb this menace. The drug addiction is a very chronic disease. Not only it's, uh, it's a medical disease, but it's a social disease. It is characterized by the compulsive or uncontrollable urge to seek drug because the person who is taking drugs becomes dependent on the drugs and it is a choice when you are doing it in at your first time however later it becomes a compulsion and addiction which cannot be easily cured by yourself so a person who is a drug addict need to be uh, need to be supported and need to be guided by the other people. So a, a holistic vision is need to be adopted in order to curb this menace. So objectives of drug addiction treatment in, must include that the person should be enabled to stop using drug and for that they need to be uh, enrolled, they need to be registered, they need to be admitted in the rehabilitation centers. So it should enable the person to uh, stay out of the drug and it should help the person to be productive. Uh, that person should equally be engaged in the more productive activities, in the more engaging activities because once he becomes a drug addict, he uh, he becomes, uh, he gets isolated with the other family members because it is uh, assumed that if the other ma family members are going closer to him, he, they may also become uh, uh, the victim of drug abuse or drug addiction. However, uh, that person need to be supported uh, after, uh, under, uh, when he or she goes under treatment, he should uh, not be uh, stigmatized. He rather should be considered the part of the family, should be considered the part of the society because he is uh, in a situation of fighting a war against uh, impulsion and against the compulsion of getting into the situation in which uh, he usually or initially had no control over it. And what should be the principles of effective treatment is that uh, addiction is a complex but treatable disease. Not single treatment is the right way for everyone. Uh, it is contextually determined that uh, to what extent a person has damaged himself and after a careful examination of the person, uh, uh, a specialist can recommend uh, that how he should be treated. So people need to have quick access to the treatment. They need to be uh, getting uh, that help. They need to be uh, admitted to such rehabilitation centers as soon as possible. So staying in the treatment long enough is more critical. The longer you stay in those rehabilitation centers, the better are the probabilities to get out of this addiction. So the treatment plan must be reviewed often and modified to fit the patient's changing needs. The treatment should address other possible mental disorders as well, which are quite associated with the, uh, with the drug addiction or with the drug consumption behavior. Sometimes. Um, the cause of drug addiction for one person uh, can sustain and even if he is treated uh, in the rehabilitation center, it is more likely that he would be engaged again in that behavior because of the cause that has not yet been addressed. So the other uh, possible treat, uh, disorder problems should also be addressed by having consultations uh, with the professional psychiatrist. The treatment does not need to be voluntary, uh, but it should be much more effective 
and drug abuse during the treatment must be monitored continuously. So if the person is still taking drugs while he or she is in treatment, it's not going to help. The treatment programs should test the patients for the HIV AIDS as well because uh, it is more likely that if a, a person is a drug addict, he or she is more likely to be uh, carrying the virus of HIV AIDS. And then uh, behavioral counseling is also effective after medication. Uh, the medical devices and application used to treat the withdrawal symptoms or to deliver the skillful training and evaluation and treatment for occurring the mental health issues such as depression and anxiety also need to be addressed while the patient is under treatment. And uh, along with that, the long-term follow-up to re-indulge the drug taking uh, needs to be monitored because once uh, you are a drug addict and even you are get uh, you have gotten the treatment from a rehabilitation center it is still likely that in your lifetime you can indulge into the drug addiction again in any time in your life so a holistic approach needs to be adopted for a continuous monitoring for a drug addict <music>